Dr. Johnson, will you come in, please? Yes, sir. Of Listen to me, Drogo Gaines. What do you think you're doing? <coughs> What's the matter with him? I think he's nuts. Here he is, Doctor. My goodness. We'd better put him on the couch. All right. Uh, lend me a hand. Okay. There we go. There appears to be no fever, and the pulse is normal. It must be a mental collapse. I'll phone for some assistance. Hey, Drogo. Come on, wake up out of this thing. Well, what now? Well, of all things, to happen to me. Yeah, happened to you. If you had married the dope two weeks ago, we'd have had the ten million, and we wouldn't care whether he did go goofy. Ma, it's all your fault. If you'd only let me marry Jerry Van Sniven. He had plenty of dough, and besides, I might have learned to love him. How did I know? Look at all the money Drogo's got. What are we going to do? We can't let those people eat all that food and stuff. Who's going to pay for it? You go out there and tell them it's been postponed. All right. Are you all right? Oh, yes, I'm all right. You mean to say that you heard everything we said? Yes. Oh, but I didn't do this for that reason. I was afraid to go out there. I realized what a momentous step I was taking. But now that I know where your affections really are, it's probably all for the best. All for the best? You're making a monkey out of me, leaving me at the altar? Well, I'm very sorry. But... Wait a minute. Everybody in this house thinks you're crazy. Now, listen to me, Drogo Gaines. You're going to marry me, or they're going to think you're crazy for the rest of your life. Oh, I don't understand. Helen, how are you going to influence those people? Help! Oh, Help! Let, Help! Let, Let me go! Let me out! Let me go! 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 Let me Oh, what's the matter, dear? Oh, poor child! Ah. 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 Ah